Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be doing stuff which is slightly different to what we usually do. We're going to go through all the different updates, all the headlines for the Season 6 live patch notes. So let me know what you're thinking so far of Season 6, how you're doing in the ranked games, and have you tried out the new Nomad car. So we'll start off with the Nomad car. It looks very similar to the Scarab in my opinion, but apparently it's got the Merc hitbox. I'm not too sure whether it does or not, but that's what I've heard. It's got the Merc hitbox. Interesting wheels. Very interesting wheels on that one. I quite like them. But yeah, so this is, I think, the Nomad GXT in the picture because it's got that little bank burner, bur bumper. So I'm not too sure, though. But yeah, I'm not a massive fan of that car. Don't think I'll use it. But anyway, we'll have a look at the headlines now. So we've got the new Season 6 Rocket Pass featuring the new Nomad car. We've got the Neo Tokyo map. Now, this is another controversial topic that I've heard. I've heard the Neo Tokyo map is basically the same as the old Neo Tokyo. We'll have to have a look on the on the game we'll go on play rocket league we'll try out the new car we'll have a look at the new map but yeah i've not heard good things about that near tokyo map but we'll get back to that season five rewards dropping come on we've got the gc rewards unfortunately we didn't get the ssl but that's all good and then additional patch notes for all for the game we don't need to look through that so season six rocket pass is out no my car with the merc hit box yep what i thought don't know whether I'll ever use it, probably not, but if anyone uses the Merc, you can try out that car, see how you do with that one. Tournaments are back, Season 6. Need to try and get the three wins again, get the red one, maybe move up to SSL tournaments. You never know, might be able to do that this season. Any unspent credits automatically converted into rewards, that's good. Then the challenges, so Season 1, Stage 1 challenges, basically the same. Competitive 6 has started, Season 6 has started, that's good to hear. A soft reset applied. I quite like hard resets, but for all you that love the soft resets, you'll be very happy. Then we've got the map here. Basically the same as near Tokyo, just what I thought. It looks maybe a little bit brighter, I'm not too sure, we'll have to have a look in the game. But yeah, it's basically the same as the old Neo Tokyo, to be honest. And now I'll have a look at new content. So we've got the Arena, Neo Tokyo. Yep, yeah, that's what we've just been through. Then the Mamba uses the Dominus hitbox. So the Dominus, that's interesting. People do like using the Dominus, especially snow day people with the flat cars, Dominuses and Batmobiles and stuff. You could try out this new Mamba when it comes out on the 10th. Um, and you'll have to let us know what you think of that one. And then the rewards. So we've got our bronze, silver, gold, platinum, diamond, champion, grand champion. But unfortunately, we didn't quite make it to Super Sonic Legend. But the, the um, gold exposure do look quite cool. I have to say they do look quite cool. And then the grand champion titles. We've got our season 5 grand champ, season 5 RNG champ, season 5 dump master, season 5 blizzard wizards, season 5 floor destroyer. But unfortunately, we didn't get any of the Super Sonic Legend ones. But hopefully this season we'll at least get the RNG Genius, maybe another one like Ice Titan or Tal Annihilator. So anyway, let me know what you're thinking of all the new updates. And we'll get into the game now and have, we'll, have, we'll have a look at the rewards in game. So if you are enjoying as well, just leave me a like. If you do quite like this sort of stuff where we go through the updates every season or if anything new comes out, let me know in the comments and we'll move it into the game now. And here we go then. So into season six we go. So here are all our here are all our goal explosions. So we've got the season five bronze goal explosion. We've got the season five silver, the gold, the platinum, the diamond, the champion, and the, the grand champion goal explosions. Let me know what you think of these goal explosions. I think they look pretty cool to be honest. Much better than season five rewards. These are a lot better than them. So let me know what you think as well down in the comment section below. And then we've got our Season 5 Grand Champion title, our Dunk Master, our RNG Champ, our Floor Destroyer, and our Blizzard Wizard title. So hopefully these will be white next season. We want to get up to Super Sonic Legend. We want the white titles. So I'm going to grind for that this season. And hopefully we'll get it in at least Rumble and maybe one other. We also got some inverted prop import wheels. We'll take them. Some Manhattan Rocket Boost. Some more wheels. Labrys, not too sure why it's given me all that, but we'll take all those every day of the week. We can do a bit of trading up in the future. Now we'll have a look into the new Rocket Pass. Where's this Rocket Pass? Here we are. So this is the new Rocket Pass. There's the new car, the Nomad. Uh, we'll get premium straight away. There we are. So there is our new Nomad car. We'll try that out 
in the new map in a few minutes so we'll okay that one so we've got the master crafter an interesting banner the anvil on the top there not much party boost all these pretty pointless interesting wheels if anyone reps those wheels let me know down in the comments so i want to see some people doing that for the fashion show so anyone that's get taking part in the fashion show you've got the advantage here if you put these wheels on and we've got the smoke sketch all of those interesting some more music all pretty basic stuff to be honest looking not too impressive the other wheels there button wash no not really my cup of tea got the cotton crown i could probably wreck that one in a few games not much more difference down here we've got a few uh, interesting banners that looks quite cool though actually on the nomad <laughs> the little face on the front we've got the out to dry uh, tyke wheels they're basically the same as the button wheels a slight change by the looks of it and we'll keep going on the monster that i like that monster you might see me wearing that in a few games that's quite funny that monster and then the rest is pretty much all similar it's not that much different to what but i mean that rocket league can't really create many more wheels now there's so many different types of wheels that they're all going to start looking similar soon another very interesting um Oh, is that an antenna? It says antenna then. Limited antenna. I'm sure that's the, uh, what's it? The decal by the looks of it. That's weird. Oh no, I suppose it is slightly, slightly like an antenna. That's quite a funny antenna. We've not had any antennas like that before. So that's one improvement this season. And all those are pretty similar. Oh, some funky wheels there. Oh, they look horrendous. Anyone that wears, oh, I don't like that with the eyes. That's not, that is not me at all. Those wheels, not that interesting. That looks like a fairly nice decal. Oh no, maybe not. The colours don't really work on that one. And we'll keep going across, have a look at some more of these wheels. They look alright. Could be better. Oh, that's a um, avatar border. That's not great. A few, a few nice wheels then out of the, in the bunch. They're not bad either. That's not too bad. Yeah, so a few nice things. Oh, that, that's a good... I like that goal explosion. Anyone that's got that goal explosion already, that is funny. I like that. <laughs> I like that. And then finally, the last car, the Nomad GXT, which is basically the same as the Nomad with the uh, back. that's slightly different. But yeah, we'll now have a look into the map then. We'll try out the Nomad car. So if we go into the garage, I'll get it all set up and then we'll get into a game on the standard map. So I'm going to go have a quick look at the car now. We'll try it out on the new map and we'll see if there's any differences that we can notice because from the pictures it doesn't look any different. So here we are, the new Neo Tokyo map. It's very very similar to the normal Neo Tokyo, let's be honest. It's very bright though. It's, it's a little bit like Salty Shores to be honest. It's basically really bright Salty Shores mixed with Neo Tokyo and that's about it. The car's quite a nice feel though. It's got a big boom on it. It's like the Merc. I'm not going to lie. I didn't think it looked like the Merc on that first picture, but when you look at it now, it looks a lot more like the Merc. Got an interesting uh, decal on it as well. It's got a very interesting uh, engine sound too. I don't know if that comes with the car or whether that's just a um, one that's already linked to it, but I'm not too sure. But yeah, so that is the map. That is the new car. Let me know what you think in the comment section below, because to me... It's not the best change in the arena, and the cars are alright, but I never use a Merc, so I don't think I'll probably ever use this car in my life, but do let me know what you think in the comments, and I'll see you all in the next one.